Hey, love bugs. It's Rosalind back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed today. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, welcome. Namaste. Love and blessings, love and light. And many blessings are yet to come for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, like, subscribe, even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. And if you feel like you resonate with my video, give me a big thumbs up, like, and even share if you feel free and if you feel comfortable enough go ahead and drop me a line or two I love to get the positive feedback especially if it's your point of view on the content of my video that I'm doing today and thank you so much for the support once again and for my returning subs what is up fam namaste love and blessings love and light and many blessings are yet to come for you and thank you so much for the love and support and coming to see about the video today Today, I am listening to 528 Hertz Awakening the God Within, Kundalini Rising and Chakra Activation Music Healing Masculine Energy. And today, my video is about Twin Flame 101. Hey, Okas, do you recognize or see the blessings around you during your struggle? Lord Jesus, take the wheel. <laughs> I'm not trying to be heavy with y'all, especially when it comes towards the weekend. But I know during the week, we go through so many struggles. And some of us are actually blessed to be off during the weekend. So that gives us enough time to unwind, be able to reflect on what we had to change during the week, what, you know, what we got to work on, or what our accomplish um, accomplishments were. So it's just like so many times we... We are so concerned and worried about the struggles that we have and the mishaps that we have and the shortcomings that we do not recognize the blessings that are coming around us. Like, if I sit up here and worry about, you know, my dad's anniversary is coming up, and I mention that a lot because it's just like this is the second year I'm dealing with it, and I know I have to come to terms with my father's passing so it, it's just like even though there's not answers or you know anything that's really been said you know I have to just come up with a you know a plan to be able to heal from it but I have to recognize all the blessings around me like lately I've been getting a mess load of friend requests all from these um different pages that has something to do with my dad and I'm just like what's going on you know why are these people gravitating towards me but when you look at a lot of the law, law of attraction videos it's just so many things that you push out there to the universe you know that's what you get back and there's so many people that love my dad for so many things that he has done you know how many things that they have he has helped them heal through you know different songs that he's made you know they they could have been going through some issues and there was a certain song that really got them through some things so it's just like you know i get that you know and i was just like what is going on what you know what is all these things going on you know talking to different hayokas and they're going through the same emotions that you're going through and you know i see more viewers that are coming out and they're you know more people are coming to the forefront on, you know recognizing their gift and what they have to offer the world and you know and I see that blessing so I can't concentrate on something that hasn't even happened yet I have to concentrate on all the blessings you know don't even have to really concentrate but actually appreciate and give yourself a pat on the back you know because it's just like dang you overcome all these things and you're helping heal and even though you're still going through stuff you're still healing from it so this you know you're making room for love so it's just like when you got things going on and i know it's hard easier said than done when you're going through stuff but try to concentrate on all the good things that's happened throughout the week for you. how many things that you have accomplished and i mean even if it's just the small things you could be a person that's used to snapping on somebody every day but there was just one or two days that you actually didn't even do it so you have to be proud of yourself for not actually going off on anybody of those 24 to 48 hours <laughs> or anything like that. So it's just like when you're going through stuff, please, whatever you do, recognize the blessings that are around you, even though if you feel like they're not really irrelevant, because there's so many things that synchronizing with you to give you that insider, you know, give you that little information that you needed to know to get through that day. 
you know, you might be watching this video and you just need something to validate, hey, you know, you're doing the right thing. You just have to pay attention to everything else around you and not worry about the negative things. Because that means when you're worried about the negative things that goes around you, you're putting too much, you're putting the energy, good energy in the wrong things. And I have to tell myself that every day because I fall suspect of that all the time. I have to never call yourself a victim. You're, you might be a suspect of something, but you're never a victim of anything. So I'm not trying to hold you up. I hope everybody has a blessed weekend. Please, like I said, like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. I'm sending out much love and light and hope and pray that everybody stays safe. Be responsible for everything you do this weekend. Even drop me a line or two so I love to get the positive feedback. And I will see you on my next video. Peace and be wild. And I'll keep doing my prayers and hope you do the same. Bye.